so I got into the energy sector um, from first of all being an engineer. Um, back in the days, I used to be a pipeline engineer. So my BS, I had my first degree um, in mechanical engineering, and then so I started my career um, in the energy sector. Started off as a pipeline engineer. Um, understood the operational part of um, laying pipes in the delta. And then I started getting bored. So I decided to understand the commercial acumen, the parts there, what we will call the sales of engineering. And so I thought to go and um, first of all started doing business development. And then I said, you know what? I rather would go and do an M MBA. So I had to do an MBA um, in engineering business managers. Um, went through that and said, okay, um, the industry started off engineering pipeline, understanding the commercial part. And so I said, okay, let's do a bit of commercial again, which will give you a bit of marketing. Um, you need to brand yourself. You need to market yourself. So I went off um, to Stanford and I did something called strategic marketing management and continued and I'm still where I am. So um, there are a few, but one of the ones that is very um, endearing to me is the fact that I see a lot of women in the space. Um, at the same time, they own this space, they're taking charge, they're extremely focused, resilient. We didn't have a, few, a lot of that um, back in the days. Now and I see a lot of female um, leaders in the industry and I'm extremely excited um, where you, you, you understand yourselves and at the same time, it's more like partnership. And so that is a peculiar one that I'm very excited about. The truth is that there is an apparent gender imbalance across the energy sector worldwide. Even when we've had countless um, studies that have revealed the importance of diversity and inclusion for increased innovation and of course, creativity. To be able to tackle these issues, especially with the looming renewable energy transition, it's of paramount importance that women's participation and contribution to the energy sector be systematically categorized. Um, as the sector transitions to a more efficient and sustainable um, renewable based system, new opportunities for a more inclusive energy um, workforce are emerging. Now, fixing the gender gap concerns could provide multiple social benefits and, and it will be accelerating innovation at the same time, enhancing um, women's opportunities and empowering communities um, to engage in that space. One of the most important um, advice I'd give to any woman coming into the energy sector. Um, first things, be extremely focused. Um, you are going to work extremely hard, harder 10 times more, um, and own your space. Um, understand a few fundamentals. Um, the industry is exciting at the same time. Um, if you're not certain of what you're doing, you will lose focus. So like I said, key advice, be extremely focused and enjoy the ride as you go by. Thank you.